we always fall into the trap of uh, blaming uh, something outside for emotions, right? When you don't see the full picture, then we begin to blame and say like, oh, you promised to take the garbage out every week, but you haven't done it. And you promised to call me and you didn't call me. You forget uh, my birthday. You know, I, I always don't remember birthdays. We don't have a custom of celebrating birthdays in Tibetan culture. So I never remember birthdays, including my sister's birthdays. Uh, <clears throat> at the beginning, I had a hard time remembering my own birthday because we don't have the custom. And I began, to, I actually learned to memorize that because they always ask me, immigration, uh, banks, uh, <laughs> my uh, <coughs> doctor's office, everybody wants my birthday. I think they all love me. <laughs> you know, they keep asking me birthdays, but they never send me a card. We always try to find a, an entity or a person outside to blame. You know, and that often happens because we don't see the whole picture of in this landscape, you know, and what we ourselves play part in that. You can see the pattern. It's not just not just the one thing or two. It's a whole pattern that is taking place there. Uh, sometimes it's you know it's clear it's a pattern of self-absorption. Selfishness, that can also be the cause of emotions, right? Not just somebody outside. And seeing patterns can actually help us to <clears throat> um, foresee when and where our emotions might be triggered. <clears throat> 